train operator London Midland has held an official launch for its new Class 350 Stroke 3 to zero EMU. The 10 strong fleet formed part of a £131 million order for 20 four car trains placed in February 2012. The other 10 are in use with First Transpennine Express on its electrified route from Manchester Airport to Scotland. The units have been delivered to leasing company Angel Trains at a rate of about one every two weeks, with the last being accepted in August. London Midlands new 350s will be used to strengthen existing commuter services into the capital via the West Coast Main Line. I mean, it's really exciting today, £62 million pounds worth of investment in these new trains. It's a culmination of a great deal of work. The real benefits of these trains will not only be seen on the West Coast, we'll be able to put thousands more seats in and out of London in the peaks, we'll be able to operate trains faster on the West Coast, but also there'll be enhancements in the West Midlands as well. Built by Siemens, 67 Class 350 train sets were brought into use between 2004 and 2009. The initial fleet of 30 units were modified in 2012 to increase their effective top speed from 100 to 110 miles per hour to make better use of limited paths on the West Coast Main Line. This involved revalidating the train's engineering designs and approvals, working through 170 potential technical issues identified by the Siemens team. The new Class 350 Stroke 3 was designed for a maximum speed of 110 from the outset, but there have been other challenges. We haven't built the Class 350 trains for some time, for about four years, so we're blowing some dust off the drawings and the manufacturing techniques have moved forward and the standards that we've had to comply with have changed. So it's been a, a sort of relearning curve almost? Uh, yes, it has been a question of relearning. Even in our factory, the techniques have moved forward and you know, some of the staff have changed, so we've had to relearn how to even build them, yes. As you'd expect, the Class 350 Stroke 3 has evolved to reflect changing needs. The radio is GSMR, there's new CCTV, both the TPWS and AWS systems have been updated to comply with the latest group standards, and there's a new fire detection system, a requirement of the latest European technical specification for interoperability. But the basic premise has been more of the same, keeping a lid on the design changes to keep approvals and training challenges to a minimum. The 350 Stroke 2 has a moving average of 136,000 miles per technical casualty, rating it highly in the Reliability League table. It's hoped the Stroke 3 will emulate that. London Midlands' new fleet will be maintained by a team of 52 technicians at Siemens Kings Heath Train Care Facility in Northampton and will progressively enter service over the next few weeks.